day today and my special, special guest, not only my special, special guest, but also my special, special friend, ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Anthony Stoneman. How you doing, Dr. Stoneman? <laughs> Fantastic and amazing. Yes, sir. It is amazing. And ladies and gentlemen, I haven't seen Dr. Stoneman in weeks. We've been, you know, chatting back and forth and talking, but we haven't seen each other for a minute, obviously, for, under the circumstances. But Doc, it's so good to see you, man. We thank God for you. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank God for you today. Back together again. Amen. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, on the globe, we're going to be talking about with Dr. Stroman. This is a quick, uh, he is really a great, great, great brother, but also a great resource and understanding of finances, ladies and gentlemen, business. Also, he's a motivational speaker. He's also a mentor, ladies and gentlemen. He's a man of God, ladies and gentlemen. He's also got some great qualities in the business world. So he's going to give us some updates today. We're actually going to catch up with Dr. Stroman, ladies and gentlemen, today on Power Connections with uh, Dr. Kevin Bond. Hey, in addition to that, also, too, uh, Brother Stroman's going to update us on this. He's a founder of Kitchen Table Movement. We're going to talk about that one. Yeah, <laughs> excited about that because he's doing some wonderful stuff in that area. And also, he's going to tell us about his teaching classes, uh, seminars, and things that he does as well. So we're excited about Doc. We just can't wait to really get up to date on what's going on with him. Well, Doc, always, you know, we always like to have our guests uh, give a kind of a, a monologue, if you will, because, you know, it's like, oh, man, is there a lot going on, Doc? Too much going on, but that's okay. But what would you like to say as we open up, Doc, to the, to the network? Thank you so much. Well, thank you. Thank you, Doc. Uh, I appreciate the opportunity to speak to all these wonderful people from the north, south, east, and west. Yes, sir. And it's always a pleasure and a treasure to be able to share information that can impact the globe. And that's what we're here to do. We're here to make a change and impact the globe. Okay, Absolutely. and um, there's three things that I'm going to be focusing on as we get into our conversation today, my brother, doctor, is yes, this. There's a lot to cover, but we're going to knock it out in a short period of time. <laughs> <laughs> Take as much time as you need, man. <laughs> but but it's, it's a lot of exciting things are happening, and I thank God every single day doors are opening up all over the nation and around the world because people are hungry for knowledge. Mm -hmm. They're looking yes. for answers. Yes. And they're looking for authenticity. Yes. And they're looking for people who have the school, the, the tools and the strategies and all the wonderful things that God put in all of us. Yes. To be able to use it to impact the world. Yes. Because, you know, we have a, dom a dominion mindset. That's right. So it's time to go ahead and operate in that dominion mindset. Now, there's three things that before I get into some of these announcements to kind of bring you up to date, Dr. Yeah. Kevin Vaughn is yeah, Yes, sir. All my platforms that I have, I, I'll name them and then I'll kind of break them down a little bit. Yeah, yeah, Doc. Every Monday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, mm -hmm. we conduct the universal principle of success class that's growing leaps and bounds. Yeah. It's about a 25-minute class, and we deal with principles because we know they're universal. Yeah, yeah. No matter what your business is, your background, family, it don't matter mm -hmm. across the board. If you operate and master these principles mm -hmm. you will succeed yeah okay yeah. and so we've been getting text messages and calls all over the country as a result of this particular platform and again none of my platforms are business opportunities so many everybody's welcome yeah okay yeah. so we do that on monday on tuesday we do what i call the prevention movement when it comes to health mm -hmm. the prevention movement and I tell people all the time, prevention is priceless, it's less expensive, yeah. and less painful. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm trying to get the mentality of the kingdom yeah. citizens to understand mm -hmm. you've got to adopt, I call a prevention mentality, yes. instead of a crisis mentality. Right. Okay? Right. right. And so prevention is priceless. And so we work with a lot of holistic doctors, educating people and taking care of the billion dollar temple. That's on Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Then on Thursday, we have our empowerment education class. That yeah. is a platform where we have entrepreneurs, great minds from all over the country. Mm -hmm. Dr. Frazier was on that platform. Yeah, okay? yeah, yeah. To get on that platform and whatever God puts on that person's heart. Right. To share that with our listening audience yep. so we can raise the standard of living yes. of humankind. Yes, yes. So we have some excellent speakers every Thursday at 9 p.m. Yeah. On Saturdays, we have our virtual conferences. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Again, when we have magnificent speakers from all across the country and around the world yeah, yeah. that spend their expertise breaking it down, Dr. Vaughn, just breaking it down and yeah, slicing man. it up yeah. and putting it on the plate and let you and serve yeah, it to yeah, me. Man. Okay? <laughs> that's what we do. Yeah, that's powerful, man. <laughs> so, so in all my platforms, I say the same thing. There's three things that I focus on, uh, Dr. Vaughn, is this. Yes, sir. One, one, number one, I believe 100% mm-hmm. that we must master headquarters. The six inches between our ears, <laughs> the most valuable real estate yes. Yes. <laughs> in the world. Yes, it is. <laughs> We've got to master headquarters. Nothing changes until your mind changes. Amen. That's always first. Dr. Vaughn, because a lot of times, even the co- conversation we're going to have today, yeah, some of the things they've heard before, yeah. but I challenge people, the reason why many people don't follow through and do them, mm-hmm. because they have not mastered headquarters. That's correct. Yeah, when I mean. decided yeah. that I'm going to live yeah. a healthy life, right. the first thing I had to do is to master headquarters. Yes. And yes. to realize how yes. valuable I am yeah. to society. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And if you don't have value, you will devalue yourself. That's exactly right. Okay? I mean, You've got to make sure to know who you are and who's you are, who you belong to. Absolutely. Okay. Yep. You got to uh-huh. master headquarters because again, uh-huh. if I say you need to do A, B, C, D, I don't care what you know. I only care about what you do. Right. Okay. Exactly. So you might know it. Right. But you're not doing it. Right. So you might well not even know it. Absolutely, Doc. Okay. It's all about execution. Absolutely. Okay? Not about it's not about emotions. Right. It's not about motivation. It's okay. about execution. Absolutely. Because if that's the part of the formula, the yeah. recipe that people need. Yes. Because a yes. lot of times people we're very emotional, we get excited, we get hyped and all that kind of stuff. But we both know, Dr. Vaughn, that it's yeah. temporary. Right. It doesn't last unless you have something stronger enough yep. to override <laughs> that thing, which is that powerful word. Yeah. That's why I would say faith come by hearing and not having heard. You got to say it again yeah. and again and again. Mastering headquarters is a daily assignment. Absolutely. It's daily. Absolutely. <laughs> because we got so much stuff coming at us. You got to master headquarters. And that's why you've known me that I'm allergic to negative people. Absolutely. I love I'm that. Allergic. Yes, sir. Okay. Allergic. I so love therefore, it. <laughs> therefore, I have to master and guard my heart yeah. and my mind against these forces because they're out there. Mm-hmm. So you got to be good at mastering headquarters. That's number one, Dr. Vaughn. I love it. The second thing that we must master is taking care of this billion dollar temple. Yeah. We have people from all over the country around the world on this platform. I don't care if you're making a million dollars a month. Right. If you don't make this health your wealth, you've heard it before. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Right. Steve Jobs worth over a billion dollars. Yeah. Health right. is about balance. So you got to master because see, we have a lot of entrepreneurs on this platform. Mm-hmm. It doesn't make sense, Dr. Vaughn, to work 14, 15 hours right. to kill yourself and leave right. the earth 30, 40 years earlier. Right. What's the benefit of that? What's the payoff? Right. And zero left. Nothing to leave. Exactly. So I try to teach entrepreneurs there's a balance. Mm -hmm. Because matter of fact, it's a known fact that when you're healthy, Mm -hmm. you're more profitable. Mm -hmm. Because see, here's the thing that you and I both know, Dr. Vaughn, is this. There's a high economic cost for bad health. There's two things I want to bring to the body of Christ. Two things very quickly. When we don't take care of our billion dollar temple, Yes. We're spending billions of dollars into the health system. That money, if we took care of ourselves, I'm talking about co-pay, the doctor, you know, the whole mm-hmm. deal. Mm-hmm. If we took care of ourselves and took that money, we could earn billions and trillions of dollars. We just have to flip the script. Right, right. But so we paying all the stuff, Medicaid, da, 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 because we don't take care of ourselves. Right, the right. second part to that, Dr. Vaughn, is this. When you don't take care of yourself and you have to lay on your back because you abuse your billion-dollar temple. Come on now. Now we're talking about lost income. Yeah. When yeah. you add the lost income, lost wages, yeah. and the money that we're spending, 
Yes. The money is in the house. Right. This billion dollar temple. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So when I go to the doctor, I like the doctors to be shocked and say, we can't find nothing, Dr. Stroman. Right. That's exactly what I expect. <laughs> okay. Exactly. So the second thing we have to do, Dr. Bond, with all these wonderful people listening in, we got to master the billion Uh-oh. dollar temple. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, exactly. Love and the song. third thing we have to master is financial power. Yeah. Financial money, right? power, because there's an intersection between your health and your finances. Yeah. You have health issues and affect yeah. your finances. You have financial issues, create stress, heart attack, worry, anxiety yeah. that affects your health. So if we can help our beloved brothers and sisters mm-hmm. to master mm-hmm. these three things, mm-hmm. then we're talking about truly living the abundant life yeah. instead of just yeah. hearing about it, yeah, quoting does. about it, <laughs> looking at the outside mirror. It's like when you walk by a restaurant yeah. and you're looking at all the good food, but you don't have access to it. Right. That's no fun. Nope. So we got to understand too that we are here to enjoy life. Yes. We don't understand some of us. Many of the kingdom citizens have what I call the waiting room mentality. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They're waiting or either an exit mentality. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, They're mm -hmm. waiting Mm -hmm. to go to heaven where they can't even enjoy themselves now. They're in a waiting room. Right. They can that we might have life and have it more abundantly. Not stress and worry and all of that stuff. That's not the plan. But so many people got this waiting room mentality right and they settle yes let me tell you something else dr bond as we go forward yes sir everybody's been tagged with talents abilities and gifts it's breaking news you can't use that in heaven you need to use it while you're on the earth that's right that's right (laughs) you gotta use it here am i right that's the mandate don't be bringing the package back that's right. That's right. Finish your work down here first. That's right. <laughs> I love That's it. Right. So we got to get out of this exit mentality. Look, yes, enjoy sir. your life, man. Listen, it's supposed to be enjoyed now. Amen. So let me break down a couple of things and we'll get into one of the main areas we want to focus on, Doctor. And we can yes, sir. stop at any time. Now, let me talk about the kitchen table movement. Yes, sir. The kitchen table movement concept came to me early one morning. The Lord woke me up in my spirit and said, Listen, crazy. We need to start the kitchen table movement yeah. lord what is that yeah we need to get the families back to the kitchen table like we used to do oh, i love it the communication is the I foundation of relationship i love it yeah. now the way it's broken down dr kevin is this we'll be do- we're going to do our goal is to have a hundred thousand family members mm-hmm. mm-hmm. hundred thousand families okay mm-hmm. and this is how we do it yes sir as you know, we have a volunteer team here, right? Volunteer right. dream team that I've formed for years. Yep, yep. Let me break it down to you. <clears throat> I love it. <laughs> we get the family together on a platform mm-hmm. virtual. Three things we want them to do. Number one, we want you to pray first. Mm-hmm. Number two, we want you to have an agenda, and we'll help yes. you with that. I'm like the quarterback, so we'll help you with that. Mm-hmm. Number three, you want to have fun after the event is over with because the brain is going to remember, Yes. oh, we had a good time. Yeah. I don't care if it's a board game, virtual board game, watch a movie, pop, whatever your thing is to enjoy yourself as a family. Yes. Because what has happened is the families are fighting because they're not communicating. Right, okay? right. And we want them, we want to have that peace, love, harmony within the family. Yep. Because yep. when they don't have that because of a lack of communication, that's when strife enters into the fray. Yes. yes. So with the kitchen table, everybody knows. Let me walk you through an example. Somebody might call me and say, hey, Dr. Stroman, and we're going to get into estate planning in a minute. Somebody called me and said, Dr. Stroman, we need somebody to tell us about stock. Right. I call up one of the dream team members who's an expert in stock. Yeah. We get 40, 50 men, members of a family together on a virtual. Yeah. We educate them about stocks. There's communication back and forth, getting information tools, and da 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 da. Mm-hmm. Next week, hey, Dr. Stroman, we need to understand about taxes. Well, mm-hmm. I contact my CPA, 
connections. Exactly. They teach them about taxes. <laughs> and Dr. Strowman, we need to know about the different types of insurance. I get one of my insurance green yeah. team members. Yeah. So it's an ongoing thing. It's a yes. movement, Dr. Vaughn. Yes. It's a movement. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. And every month the family gets together. Now, mm. the beauty of it is this. The feedback has been amazing across the nation. Yes. Yes. It's simply been amazing. Yes. And I'm going to walk you through an example, a real life example that took place. Um, this right. was the first thing that we do in the kitchen table is to go over what we're going to talk about right now, Dr. Bond. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is making sure that you have a master plan when it comes to having a comprehensive mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. estate plan. Yes. <laughs> for middle class. Now, you know why I took my time to say middle class? Because when we hear the word estate plan, we automatically, many of us, says that's not for me it's for the wealthy people right let me help all of you out it's for the middle class right the wealthy people can spend do what they want they got money to do anything yeah exactly. so this thing is state planned and here's another challenge that i have for people it's like well dr stroman do i need to have an estate plan i don't have much but here's my question are you planning on staying that way right because they might have a house, they have a car, they have a bank account, but in their mind, when they're not thinking like kingdom citizens, they're thinking, I don't have enough. Why should I have an estate plan? I'm going to break down in a minute here why you need to, but just off the cuff, it messes yeah. people's mind yeah. up. I, I don't have a bunch of stuff. I don't have $10 million, Dr. Vaughn. Right. So that's a misconception about the estate plan. Yeah, exactly. With I'm with you, man. <laughs> Powerful, Doc. Powerful. Powerful. The it. other thing that we have a challenge with when it comes to the comprehensive yeah, yeah. estate plan, I say it on purpose, comprehensive, I'm going to break it down in a minute, Wow. is that we think if we plan to put this together, mm -hmm. we're thinking about leaving here. Right, right. Now, I'm a, I'm, I don't get this. <laughs> we're kingdom citizens. Yeah. Right. When you do leave here, you go into heaven, right? Right. What is this fear about talking about this? Right. Because it's reality. We all have a unless you have some <laughs> special whatever I don't know about. <laughs> we all got a date. Yep, you got a date. Don't make it a big deal to talk about it. You got to get comfortable being uncomfortable talking about this because it's real. Because I'm telling you right now. Yep. When you don't. And that thing blow up in your face. Now we got strife and right. fighting right. all over the country with family members because nobody yeah. knows what to do. That's right. Preparation time is not wasted time. Right. So here's Perfect. the way I say it. Preventing strife in the family is priceless. Mm -hmm. And what I call it, when you do it, you're leaving a love letter to your family. Wow. And here's the other thing that you're doing, which love is invaluable peace of mind yeah doc yeah that's huge yeah that's, that's i did a family i did a family not too long ago yeah. and the mother i think she's like 80 88 years old mm -hmm. when we put the comprehensive plan together she had sector at least she had six yeah. siblings yeah yeah she had so much peace because yeah. now everything yeah. was done like the bible says decent and in order. Oh, now, Doc. Yeah. Man, yeah. she was yeah. peaceful, man. Yeah, yeah absolutely. If doc. You don't understand the type of peace yeah. you get. Right. Yeah. Because yeah. we want you to be in peace. We don't want you to go to pieces. Right, right. We want you to be in peace. Amen. And I tell people all the time get it done, live life to the fullest, and enjoy your life and complete your divine assignment. Come Put on. it behind you and enjoy your life. But this fear about it, I don't want to talk about it. Yeah. What? Yeah, yeah. We got to get out of this. Believers, right. yeah. afraid to talk about this. Right. Okay? Amen. So use my words. You're leaving a love letter. Okay? <laughs> I love it. Beautiful. That's what Beautiful. you're doing, leaving a love letter. Exactly, now, Doc. I love it. That's it. Now, here's the that's deal. Tough. One of the things I'm always talking about in teaching is that disease called procrastination. Right, Dr. Yeah, Bond? Yeah. Oh, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, 
we need a vaccine for procrastination. <laughs> procrastination has become a profession for people. Right, right. They're still good at it. Yeah. But we need a vaccine. We need to be vaccinated for that, man. Exactly. A big and I'm, talking to, I'm talking to families and they're saying, yeah, yeah I, want, I know this is important, Dr. Stroman. I need to get it done. But out, da, 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 da. Right. Well, let me ask you a reason. What's, don't you want to protect your family? Here's the thing I break down. Don't you want to protect your assets? Don't right. you want to leave things for your heirs? Yeah. Don't you want to leave a legacy? Don't you? Yes, yes, yes. There's no perfect time. Perfect time is right now. No. Right. It's and people don't even know, they don't even know why they're waiting. It's like a spirit of procrastination. Right, right. So why are you waiting? Right. And they say to me sometimes, Doc, I don't know. Right. It's just a habit. It's a reflex. Yes, exactly. Doc. A logical it. reason, unless there's economic, and with this program, we break this down today. Right. Economics is a piece of cake because this thing is so inexpensive with the attorneys that we're working with. <laughs> So we got that out of the way. Exactly. Okay? Now here's the thing. <clears throat> Let's break down the family for a second because this could because there's a lot of what I call complex social situations. Mm -hmm. The latest statistics, there's only about 35% mm. of a normal household, husband, yes, wife, sir. kids. Yes, sir. 65% blended adoption remarriage, all kind of social situations in the household. Mm -hmm. And when you don't have this estate plan set up, it can be a nightmare. Yeah, Doc. Okay? Yes, yes, sir. So yes, now sir. watch this. What wow. is a comprehensive estate plan? Mm -hmm. Many people, when I do seminars and radio shows, they will say, oh, I have a will. Right. And I have to educate them, which you know I'm a teacher. I love doing that. Yep. Right? So I said, well, yep. ma'am, sir, that's only 25% of a comprehensive estate plan. Oh my God, Dr. Stroman, I thought a will was enough. Right. Ma'am, sir, it is not enough. Right. Wow. So here's how it's broken down. First of all, 62% of Americans don't even have a will. Right. I'm talking about millions of kingdom citizens, Dr. Vaughn. That's right, Doc. Right. 87% don't have a living trust that I'm going to break down here in a minute. Wow. 87%, no living trust. Wow. wow. Now we're quoting scriptures and I'm going to yeah. leave inheritance for my children. Right. Right. That right. stuff sounds good. Right. But if you ain't put no execution behind it, you're fooling right. yourself. Exactly. Self deception. Yep. And Someone we had else. a sad story. I have to say this to make it real. Mm -hmm. We had a man of God, a man of God, told his wife that he had everything set up. Right. This happened about a couple of months ago. This is not a happy story, but I want people to feel what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. please. Please tell he us. He got ill. He made his transition. Right. Come to find out hmm. this man of God didn't have nothing wow. in place. Wow. So the wife, going through the grief of losing her husband, right. also at the same time, angry because he told her right. that he had things in order right. and it was not in order. Can't even get to the bank account. Yeah. Yeah. He didn't have nothing set up. Yeah. And yeah. he told her he did. Yeah, I understand, Doc. This is yeah. why we got to get this communication down, Pat, because here's what yeah. happened. Yeah. See, when the family is sitting at the table, yeah. when the husband and wife says, son, you can have $100,000. Right. You can have this automobile. Right. You can have this house. Right. Everybody's hearing it at the same time. Right. And it's being recorded and they're taking notes. So the right. siblings can't come back and say, right. listen, right. mommy said I can have that car. Do you want right. me to play the recording for you? Right. Where's the documentation? I got the Hello. Yeah. Documentation yeah. beats conversation. Every time. Right? Every time, Doc. Every it time. is written. Yeah. Yeah. Because here's something. You you like this? Check this out, Dr. Vaughn. Yes, sir. <laughs> if, it's in, if it's in writing. There yep. will be no fighting. If it's in writing, yep. there will be no fighting. That's what the courts see, my friend. Come on now. <laughs> yeah, I love now, it. Powerful. Powerful. Let me shift here just a second and talk about long-term care just for a second. Mm -hmm. Guys, we got to have strategies for this stuff. Do you understand that the, the, the lane that you and I in, Dr. Vaughn, about the yes, health sir. thing? Yes, sir. 
I believe that long-term care is taking care of your health long-term. Hello. Yeah, yeah. You know how you can avoid nursing homes? Do you know 80% of the people in the nursing home are women? Right. They call it long-term care, but the average person lives two and a half years. That's not too long. That's short-term nope. care to me. Nope. If we took care of ourselves, imagine right. staying in your home at 95 and 100 and right. 105 at right. the house. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because in this environment right now, mm -hmm. you don't want to have to go to a nursing home. Nope. It can cost eight to ten thousand dollars a month. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Check this out. If you don't have things structured properly, mm -hmm. that the nursing home, this is a government program. Here's the deal. They they can't come at your car right now in your house. Right. But once the person makes the transition, mm -hmm. they can come back and say, We done spent a hundred thousand right. dollars on your kid. Right. We're gonna force you to sell your house right, to right. pay us back. Now, who right. wants that? Right. You want the house to be for your heirs, right. leaving the legacy in your family. Now, the government is taking the house, right. your CD, right. your broker's account, yeah. your, 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 your lock box, and the, yeah. all these things. They're coming after your money because they gotta pay this back because see, there's something called a five-year look back. Mm. That wow. you, there's strategies that we can protect your assets. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. we don't know about this. Nope. We got to be more strategic. Yes. We have to understand the rules of engagement. Yes. Okay. Yeah, to protect it. our asset. You work that hard and you got a $300,000 house and all of a sudden the government, Medicare, come and take it and make you right. sell it. Right. Hello. Yeah. Not good. Not no, it's good. Not good. Not, not good at all. So here's, no. here's the other thing. Hmm. Here's the four things about this uh, amazing comprehensive program that we have the first thing is the will now when it comes to the will if you don't have that set up and somebody has young kids yeah who's going to take care of your kids right do you want them to be wards of the state nope hello now so you have a will and i'm gonna break down the difference between the will and the living trust in a minute mm -hmm. you have a will you have a living trust which is more superior than the will let me say it again. Living trust is for mm -hmm. the will. Living trust more superior than a will because while you have a living trust, you can alter it throughout your lifetime. I'm going to break down the differences in a minute. Yeah, yeah. The third one is having what we call health power of attorney. In this environment, for an example, let's say someone's in the hospital and they're fighting cancer. Yes, sir. And you have the medical records, you have access to the doctors, you are responsible for the care of your loved one. Mm -hmm. They want to give your loved one sugar. Mm -hmm. We know that cancer mm -hmm. loves sugar. If you're a health advocate, you're going to say, don't put that insure in my loved one's body right. or all those artificial stuff in sugar. Right. Cancer loves sugar. It's mind blowing what these oncologists are doing. I'll leave that alone. Mm -hmm. It's mind blowing. Mm -hmm. So when you're a health advocate, you can say no. Right. I want my loved one to have something natural. Yeah, yeah. That's why having the health power of attorney is critical. Yeah. The financial power of attorney. Oh, this is a biggie right here. Mm -hmm. With the financial power of attorney, if somebody is incapacitated, mm -hmm. Alzheimer's, dementia, whatever. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. You got to kind of like sue your loved one to have access to their funds. Right, right. Now, the bills have to be paid. Water bill, gas bill, yep. water, electric, all that stuff is going on, right? Yep. If you don't have financial power of attorney, you do not have the authority. Right. That's on right. behalf of your loved one to take care of business. That's right. It happened to a friend of mine at my church. Yeah, I see you. Her yeah. brother had to come from another state to handle business for her. Right. But everybody needs to have a financial power of attorney. Because yeah. let's be honest, we kingdom citizens, but right. life can be unpredictable. Right. Absolutely. So Absolutely. you want to put these things in place. Okay? Yep. Now watch this. You ready for this? I am. Not we are. Part? Yes, sir. Let me say this before I move into this deal. What me and Dr. Vaughn are talking about this evening to all you beautiful people, 
this is an epidemic in our community and in the church. Right. It's an epidemic. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now, we've had some people that celebrities that didn't have this stuff in place, which is right. also mind boggling. Yeah, it is. That really is. Yeah. You're talking about Black Panther, man. Come on, man. Yeah. All that work. You, you, you're talking about Black Panther, Jimi Hendrix, and yeah. Prince. Come yeah. on. Yeah. What are we doing? Yeah. I know, Doc. Yeah. I don't understand that. With all this. <laughs> so sad. Anyway. Yeah. Very sad. Yeah. Anyway, so let's break down the differences between these two. What is the difference between a will and a living trust? When somebody has a will, Mm -hmm. If somebody make their transition to heaven, you have to go through probate. Okay. Probate can be very costly. Yes. Stressful. Yes. Emotional. Yes. The court systems are backed up because of COVID. Yep. You do not want your loved, loved ones to have to go through probate. It's expensive. Yep. Sometimes the attorneys can get a percentage of your estate. How about them getting two to three percent wow. of your estate? Wow. How about every time you go back to the attorney to change something, you got a new baby, you got a son, somebody get married. Every wow. time you go back to the attorney, ching, 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 ching. Yeah. Our program, when you get it done, is for life. Yeah, duh. There's no extra nothing. So watch this. So we got the will. You got to go through probate. Mm -hmm. it's, it can be public. Hello. <laughs> um, time consuming. Okay. And the loved ones are in disarray. Right. Now, let's compare that to a living trust. If folks, don't worry about it. I know I'm going as fast. Don't worry. You got a website. You can do all your due diligence. Yeah, yeah we're going to get some information about it. Yeah. Okay. Now, you tell me the difference. Now, let's talk about a living trust. A living trust, you can avoid probate. Oh my God, avoiding probate? <laughs> Saving all that money and headache and stress and worry for your family? Sounds like a good plan to me. It's already difficult enough when somebody make the transition, you gotta make funeral arrangements and all that. You gotta deal with this too? Yeah. Oh my God. Right. So you avoid probate, it can be private. Hmm. Let me sum it up by saying this part of it. A will, you're playing by the rules of the court system. Mm -hmm. When you have a living trust, you're playing by your rule book. Which rule book did you want to go, did you want to play? <laughs> with? Hello? Definitely the latter, ladies and gentlemen. Definitely right. Yeah, so when you have a will, yeah. remember, I, I'm going to reiterate something. Your assets are frozen. You can't do nothing. Mm -hmm. When you have a living trust, they're not frozen. I love All it. you need is the birth, you, listen, you need a death certificate. Mm -hmm. Your documents, like I have right here, I have yeah. mine set up. And I'm a challenge you married folks. I'm single, no kids, and I have mine set up. Hello. Yeah. That's a challenge. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You get that notarized sign and all that good stuff. Yeah. Go to the bank, go to the groceries count. I can sell my house. See, when you got when you got a will, you gotta go through probate. You can't even sell a house. Right. It's frozen. Right. Oh, you gotta live in trust. You can sell a house. It's right. less expensive. No courts, no lawyers. Oh my goodness, less stressful, less emotional. And there's no add-on, anything yeah. like that. It's simple process compared to this difficult situation. Mm -hmm. It's simplified. Yes. That's why everybody needs to have a living trust. Yes, I love it. That's the comprehensive plan because many people, Dr. Vaughn, will leaving bills or are you leaving benefits? Right. What do you want to do? Leave bills or benefits? Okay. Absolutely. And some people, unfortunately, because of the COVID situation, they were in the hospital, but the, the, the mortgage company didn't know that. Right. They're coming out of the hospital, houses foreclosed. Right. All the, all the utilities turned off. That's right. Because yeah. we don't put these things in place. Right. Exactly. Doc. Powerful. Powerful area. Oh, my God. Doc, so anyway. Doc. Doc, this is good. This is good. I just want to make sure we want to do a commercial break because I want folks to. Some folks say, "Okay, Doc, what I got to do?" <laughs> oh, Doc, oh. get ready for that to tell, so people can know where to contact you about this area right now. We're gonna get this back to you in a minute, Doc. But uh, we want to make sure this is very serious, folks. Please understand that we have Dr. Anthony Stroman, ladies and gentlemen, uh, author. He's an awesome speaker, no doubt about that. Y'all know that as well, and of course, a businessman. But the, uh, guys, we're talking about your life. We're talking about your family's life right now. 
And one thing we got to take care of, he talked about it. We got to get this mindset changed, right? That's the first thing he talked about. We got to get that body right, ladies and gentlemen, so you can live your wonderful life. And then we got to get that financial side of our lives as well. Now, Doc, one thing I wanted to mention to everybody, the fact that this is very serious and we want you to take action. We don't want you just to listen to this and then say that was another great story or great information from Doc today. You're going to have to take some action. Please do that. Matter of fact, as you know, Les Brown, as you know, Brother, Brother Stroman, he said, you got to be hungry, folks. You got to be hungry to make a change. So we want you to really understand that this is so important. And I think a lot of people get it now because of the past year, Dr. Stroman, that, that things, how important things are to get done <laughs> like this. That's right. So I think they understand that, but now you have to take action. That And if some of you may have already done that, that's wonderful. But we've got to get the rest of everybody on this plan. Guys, you have to do this because you want to be, most people will say, yeah, I want to do that. And then Dr. Stroman mentioned earlier, we'll get it done. <laughs> okay, if you want to do it, guess what, Doc, if I, if I wanted to leave the studio right now, I say, what? Well, let's well, go do it. Don't keep talking about it. You know, you just leave. You know, but the point is, you got to take action, ladies and gentlemen. That's all it is. And I understand you got distractions, you got opportunities, but you have to take action. That's what Dr. Stroman uh, was sharing with us a little earlier. And also, too, ladies and gentlemen, I, I, was, I always love. You know, we loved Miles Monroe, ladies and gentlemen, one of the best orators on the planet. And he talked about if you don't understand a thing, you tend to abuse it. Basically, I'm paraphrasing there what he said. But if you don't understand the thing, you tend to abuse it. And sometimes it's ourselves. And that means we have to get that resolved. So we want to definitely have you take action. And Doc, I want these guys to push this out. I want everybody on LinkedIn, Twitter, uh, Web Talk. I want uh, also next door. When I push this out, I want you guys to push this out to your families, guys. And Doc's going to give us some information later how to get in touch with them. But you have to take action in this area of your state and of your wills. Ladies and gentlemen, it's so important that you understand it. But most of all, Doc, they're going to have to, they're going to, have to get the education first. Obviously, people right. got to know what they're doing. And that's where this comes in as well. But I just wanted to make sure people understand this is very serious. I want you to take action, ladies and gentlemen, today. And Doc's going to give us some more information on how to get in touch with uh, him and the program and, and all he's doing as well. But ladies and gentlemen, this is Power Connections with our wonderful guest, Dr. Anthony Stroman. And we're talking about your life, ladies and gentlemen, and we want you to have it more abundantly as we know that our Lord and Savior uh, loves to have for you today. We want you to enjoy your life and get rid of the stress, get rid of the issues, get rid of the, uh, the unrest that we have today in these areas. So you don't want to add, there's enough going on, Doc, already. We don't want to add to it. So ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get back to Doc right now, but I wanted to really encourage you to take advantage of this information Dr. Stroman is sharing with us. So uh, we're excited about you guys as well. Hey, you guys, so drop some uh, comments in the network if you want as well. Got some comments uh, in the network if you want to do that. And uh, we'll be glad to entertain it. But thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, for those who are joining us all across the globe on uh, Power Connections with Dr. Anthony Stroman and Kevin Vaughn. Back to you, Doc. I just wanted to share that because this, this is powerful information and very needed information. Thank you so much. Well, well thank you, Dr. Vaughn. I appreciate that, my friend. Um, let me let me do this. Um, I'm going to make a... Um, yeah, I'm going to give out some information real quick, if you don't mind. Yes, sir. Whatever you want to do, Doc. Yeah, one of the things that's also a challenge when somebody makes a transition, uh, they don't we, don't. we can't find life insurance policy. We can't right. find anything. Right. Right. And we have something called what we call a, a financial lockbox. It's, uh, it's like in the yeah. cloud. Yeah, yeah. The thing is there, all your information is one yep. place. That's something else that we recommend because yeah. we don't have things together. Now, here's the deal. I'm going to give you some websites here in a second. Yes, sir. But before I do that, I do want to encourage everybody about the virtue conference that we do on Saturday. Yeah, yeah. If I could take a moment, Dr. Vaughn. Absolutely, I'm... absolutely. Well, this coming Saturday, we have a powerful virtue conference we call the Power of Financial Education. And remember, all my platforms are strictly empowerment and education. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the speakers that we're going to have, you might know her, her name is Dr. Yeah. Bethune. She is the granddaughter of Dr. Mary McLeod Mathun. Thank you. Yeah. A pioneer. Okay. Awesome woman of God. A grandmother, educator, yeah. civil rights leader, political you. activist, president advisor to four presidents. Yeah. Yeah. This is the granddaughter that's going to be breaking down wow. the PPP loan program for all you entrepreneurs. You do not wow. want to 
miss it. It's yeah. absolutely free. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Like I've said before, many times, occasions, poor people entertain themselves. Rich people educate themselves. Thank you. Thank you. Okay? Thank We're you. talking about my com our conferences are not very long. They're not five and six hours. All right. We knock it out in about an hour and a half. It's three speakers. Right to the point. Let's get straight to it, right, yeah. Doc? That's right. We we hit it and quit it. So we have one gentleman that's going to talk about yeah. when you put your plan together financially, yeah. there is a tool out there, Dr. Vaughn, that wow. the government cannot tax your money. You can earn money on it, but it cannot <laughs> be taxed. I love it. Don't want to miss that Saturday at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Wow. And I'll make sure Dr. Vaughn get the link. I'll send Absolutely, man. We're going to push that. Yeah. And then we have, we have uh, of course, Dr. Evelyn Bethune. Yeah. She's going to bring it. She's going to bring it about the PPP program. How do you do it? What's the documentation? Yeah. What's the pro She's going to yeah. break all that down. Yeah. She's an expert yeah. in that. Yeah. And then myself, I'm going to talk a little bit about, again, the state planning, but I'm yeah. also going to talk about business credit. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. you need to understand, you need to have business credit in this environment, but not the type of business credit that you know. Right. This is a different flavor. Right. Okay. You need to find out what that's about. So we want to help. One of our goals, Dr. Vaughn, is to help 100,000 business people to be successful. Yeah, yeah. That's one of our goals for 2021, 100,000 yeah. business people. And so providing all these resources. So we want, because we believe business people can change the world. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Absolutely. We believe we have the solutions to all the ills of the world. Entrepreneurs is doing things ethically and morally right, providing services that enhances the lives of people. Yeah. That's what this movement is about. Right. Okay. Oh. Now, so let me give out some personal information here because I have a, uh, let's see, I have my class tonight at eight. That's okay. We good, Dr. Barnes. My, that class, guys, don't, don't sneeze on that class. And I'll, I'll list them out the bag. <laughs> the class tonight is going to be about the power of positive confection, Come confession on now. over your business. Come on now. Good. The power mm -hmm. of positive yeah. confessions yeah. over your business. Mm -hmm. We're going to deal with that tonight for all these entrepreneurs that's going to get on the class at 8 o'clock. Yeah. What are you saying about your business? Yeah. Okay. Powerful. Now, so let me give out some information just in case, in case somebody yeah. wants to see the next Yeah, time. Doc. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, give us that information about tonight for sure. Okay. So for those, yeah. Okay. Tonight's, tonight's I'm going to give you the conference line for tonight. Mm -hmm. 712. Mm -hmm. 775-7031. The pin code is 715-084, 8 p.m. Eastern mm -hmm. Standard Time. Eastern Standard Time. I love it. We don't keep you long, 25 minutes, we're done. Get your, get your okay? notepad, folks. Get your notepad and paper ready. Yeah, we roll now. Yeah. yeah. Also, let me give it the website. I'm going to give out two websites for the estate plan for those that are serious. For some people, are serious about not being serious. Right. Did you catch exactly. that? Yeah, I got it. Some people yeah. are serious about right. not being serious. That's procrastinators, bro. What did, I, what did I bring to America? I told you years ago. What I brought to America called lip aerobics. Right. Yeah, I was going to ask you to mention that. <laughs> yeah, you got a medal. Y'all can get a medal for that if y'all want to. <laughs> yeah, boy, a gold medal. Because um, I think what happens when people say things, yeah, they're entertaining themselves. They mean well. <laughs> They're entertaining themselves. But listen, you know, my, what do I say, Dr. Vaughn? Procrastination is the assassination of right. your financial destination. Yes, yes. Like I said, you need a vaccine. Yes, Some yes. got master's degrees in it. Absolutely. They have no logical reason why. Absolutely. Doc, tell, anyway. them, about, tell them about the nation that's uh, the biggest nation on the planet is procrastination. The biggest nation <laughs> is definitely procrastination. Yeah. That's right. So, so I'm gonna give out a couple of websites. The first website is an educational website. Yeah. Video, frequently asked questions, all the information that you need to know for the most part about our comprehensive estate plan. Mm -hmm. Once you get this plan, you can change it a thousand times. There's no extra fees. There's wow. no add-on. Wow. Nothing. Wow. You go to a regular attorney every time you go back there. Mm -hmm. Every time you can charge your fee. 
And that's why people are blown away to see how inexpensive it is. Yeah. We got yeah. customer service. Right. You do it online at your own pace. Mm -hmm. And we have all the support to help you to walk through all the questions, all the legal right. legal right. needs, all that's covered. Not a problem. Right. right. So here's the first website, www.financialedu.services.com. I will repeat that. Mm -hmm financialeduservices.com. That's an educational website of the overview what I shared this evening with Dr. Vaughn and all you wonderful people. Yes. Click on the frequently asked questions and you get a lot of answers right there. Amen. Now for those that are serious, because I might have a few, we might have a few serious people. Yeah. I'm going to give you the website for those that are serious who's ready to take action and not just talk about it, but be about it, okay? Write this down, www.myfes.net forward slash the letter A, Stroman, mm -hmm. S-T-R-O-M-A-N, myfes.net forward slash A, Stroman. You click on product. Mm -hmm. Then click on My Care. It takes six minutes. I love it. To get it set up. <laughs> That's it. Six minutes, and then within 24 hours, you'll get your password and your username. And they're going to ask you questions: Who you want the house to go to? You just type right. the information in. Right. Have any questions? We got customer service with the attorneys. You ask questions. Everything is right there. But Dr. Vaughn, those for the serious people, not the one that's participating in lip aerobics. Those who take action, folks. That's what we're right. talking about. <laughs> that's right. powerful, Doc. That is so good. So that's that's I... the deal with the websites, Dr. Vaughn. Yes, sir. And I really want to emphasize that this conference Saturday, we have some major um, yeah. movers and shakers around the nation that's going to be uh, on that conference. I mean, we got, I mean, board members and what have you, some yeah. powerful people. Yes, sir. And remember, Dr. Mary McClub. Dr. Mary Bethune, uh -huh. she was a liberator for women. Yes, yes. Really. African American. Yes. Listen, every African American young lady to get that sense of pride and right. connectedness, right. they need to know the history of this powerful woman. Yes, yes. Starting yes. school with a dollar and fifty cents. Right. And what she had to go through. Right. And now we have a, a respected university. Yes. As a result of her vision and yes. her tenacity. Lord Jesus. Okay? Get the women on this platform Saturday, okay? Yes, sir. So let's summarize a couple of things. I'm going to give a couple of takeaways, okay? Dr. Yes, Vaughn, sir. can I do yes, that? Yes, sir. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Doc, also, too, the folks know how to get to the uh, to the Saturday event. You, you mentioned that yet? Yeah, I'm going to send you the link. Okay, great. So we'll put that I'm going to send it to Dr. Vaughn, the link, guys. Okay. All you Good guys deal. have to do is he'll forward the link to you. Good deal. So we'll or get that out. email me, either one. I'll send it to you, Dr. Vaughn, and okay. I'll let you Okay, happen. good deal. Good deal. We'll get that to you guys. So those listening out there, you guys text me or let me know if you want it. But we'll, we're going to make it available to you out there. We'll do some commercial breaks again, uh, Dr. Uh, Stroman, in a minute too as well. Back to you, my friend. So I'm going to leave some nuggets of food, to, food for thought. Yeah. Say some reasons why you need to have an estate plan. I'm going to summarize it with this. First of all, let me say this. Yeah. The three things that we talked about in the beginning of our conversation, you got a master headquarters. Mm -hmm. You got to master your billion dollar temple. Yep. You got to master financial power, whatever that means to you. You yep. fill in the blank. Yep. Financial power might mean $100,000 a year. It yep. might mean $10 million a year. Because yep. we know as kingdom citizens, the more money we have, we can advance the kingdom. Yep. Okay. Gospel is free, but it's not cheap. <laughs> right? Yeah. The main reason is to advance the kingdom. Yep. Never be shy. If God put in your heart to make $10 million, you can build hospitals and nurseries and all the stuff you can do takes money. Right. You can't go to the cashier, praise the Lord. That's nope. not going to get Nope. So we got to understand, we got to understand God made the spiritual and the natural. We cannot ignore the natural things. Right. And my mantra is this. Diligence and management is the driving force of achievement. Yeah. Let me say that one more time. Yeah. Diligence and management is the driving force of achievement. Now, here's some takeaways real quick, and I'm going to end this uh, nice conversation with my dear friend. Yes, Dr. Uh, Dr. Stroman. 
when you set up your estate plan, mm -hmm. you got to be very specific. Yeah. There's certain things inside the house. There's what we call a special letter because a lot of times when somebody set up an estate and say, my house can go to that person mm -hmm. or whatever the case may be, mm -hmm. but then they're fighting for the stuff that's inside the house. Mm -hmm. Well, I can have the artwork. I can have the TV, the computer. You got to write a separate letter for that stuff to create, to reduce strife. Right. I got a friend in California, him and his sister fought so hard because the mom didn't have a will right. and my friend wound up with a stroke, Dr. Vaughn. This no. is serious because that. of the stress. Yeah. So I'm gonna go through some things real quick. Okay, help mm. to prevent disputes, amen? Yes. Provide for your grandchildren. Yes. I know a gentleman who actually bought land and his son and daughter is not even married yet. You're talking about thinking legacy and advance. Yeah. He bought the yeah. land for the grandkids right. and his son and daughter is not even married yet. You're talking right. about forward thinking? Oh my right. God. Right. Provide for your grandchildren. Provide for your spouse. Yep. Avoid the government taking all the stuff that you work hard for. Yep. You have to understand there's sometimes end of life decisions. That's in the will. Yeah. That's a tough call, Dr. Vaughn. Yeah. End of life decision, you got to have that stuff set up because you don't want to put that burden on a loved one. Nope. Don't want to do it. Okay. Provide charity. Some people want to leave money to the church and different things. Right. You got to put that in there, okay? Yep. Provide for yep. charity. Yep. Okay. Who's going to sell your estate? You got to find a trusted person, then a backup person, then a backup person. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Somebody have pets. You got to provide for that. Yeah. Yeah. Take care of special needs kids. You got to provide for that. Yeah. Some people, wow. of course, guardians, you got to make sure you provide for that. Yep. Some people, unfortunately, I hate to say it, but I, I'm living the times that we're living right now. I call it the divorce proof. Yeah. Sometimes, Dr. Vaughn, yes, divorces sir. can happen. Yes, sir. Sometimes the daughter was, everything was left to the daughter. All right. And they, and for some, whatever reason, they had sprain with the son-in-law. Right. The daughter-in-law make a transition. Now the son-in-law can have all the legacy stuff okay. and was meant for the daughter and the kids. Right. I know that's a touchy topic. Woo! Yeah. Out there. They yes. call that divorce proof. Wow. Who handle your money when you're sick? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's if a good you one. have a business, and most people do on this platform, yeah. who's going to handle your business? You got $100,000 coming of income. Do yeah. you have that designated? So the money can come, go to your kids or your grandkids. Mm -hmm. How about your business partner? Do mm -hmm. you have one? Mm -hmm. Who's going to take over your business? Folks, I'm giving you food for thought. Yeah. Okay. Uh, protect your children from inheritance. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. you have kids that are irresponsible. Right. Do you want to give them a million dollars, Dr. Vaughn? Nope. Ain't going to do it. And I know it's a tough talk. We're having tough love right now. Yep, somebody can be, nobody on this platform, somebody can be on drugs. They right. can be an alcoholic. Right. Are you going to give them a million dollars? Ain't going to happen. You're hurting them more than helping them. I know this is a tough meet I'm giving you yeah. right now. I love it. Sometimes people get remarried. Right. Okay. They got two separate households. Right. How are you going to set that up? Wow. Okay. Wow. It's a lot. I know I oh, yeah. a lot out there. Yeah, because we can't navigate, Doc. We cannot do it on our own. We cannot navigate none of that. Matter of fact, I'd be in a loony farm. Y'all be visiting me <laughs> up in the loony farm, man. After all, trying to pull all that together without this type of system. And that's the whole thing, guys. We want you to be prepared, ladies and gentlemen. This is why we have uh, Dr. Stroman on on our power connections, because he's a power player and he's not playing. And folks, we're not playing right now. We have to give you this information. Now, obviously, Doc, we can't force nobody to do nothing. <laughs> we ain't trying to do that. All we can do is expose you to the information, that's share right. the information to you. But what I like about Dr. Stroman's program Doc, the fact that he'll walk you guys through that program. If you're willing to listen, he'll walk you through it, give you time to go through it. I think that's what the deal is, Doc, that the COVID situation has really slowed us down, all of us up down a little bit, so we can get out of the stuff that we don't really need in order to hear what we really need to hear. That's what we're doing today. So thank God for you today, Doc. So that's well, my that, pleasure, man. My, my uh, pleasure. You know, it's always a wonderful pleasure. And I hope yeah. um, as I get ready to close, Yes, sir. You know, Dr. Vaughn and myself, you know, we cover some yeah. ground this evening and yeah. we want you to know we do it in love. Exactly. Oh, yeah. You know, Definitely. We, we, we love you and we yeah. know as King, yeah. Kingdom citizens, we just want the best for all of you. Absolutely. You deserve the best. Yes. That is your right. 
Yeah. Okay. But again, execution. Yeah. Not not just emotion. Exactly. exactly. Not just perspiration, but information. Because many times in churches we get a lot of perspiration. Right. We need information. Right. Exactly. Strategic planning is key. Yes. yes. Management is key. Yes. You can't yeah. just I'm excited. I'm excited. Yeah. No. Yeah. We gotta get down to strategic planning. Right. Right. Management. Yes. Productivity. Yes. Excellence. Yes. yes. This is what the kingdom is supposed to represent. Yes. Okay? And yes. the last, next to the last thing, when you put these things in order with the kitchen table that we talked about earlier. Yeah, yeah, Doc. Guess what? You're putting, making a deposit in the younger generation. Yes. Because when they get older, yeah. I need to get my documents in order because my daddy and mommy did it. Right, right. You have no idea right. the principles that you can leave with them for generations right. to right. come. Good point. Let's stop leaving our generation vulnerable. Right. Because many families have to start off with ground zero yeah. because we don't protect this well. Right. Right. Start started from ground zero. We got to stop that. Absolutely. Okay? Absolutely. So as I get ready to close, Dr. Vaughn, remember, in an hour from now, I'm doing the Universal Principal Success class. Yes. Saturday with yes. Dr. Bethune. You don't want to miss that for business people. We're going to have 500 to 1,000 business people on that platform. Yep. We call it all entrepreneurs. Okay. Yep. And uh, the kitchen table movement, you just have to reach out to me. And I give out my style number because we want to help 100,000 families yeah. to live the abundant life and bring that communication, peace, yeah. love, and harmony. It is a beautiful thing when family members yeah. work together Amen. in peace and harmony. So my cell number, just in case, is 678-907-3135. And the last thing, Dr. Vaughn, yes, I didn't sir. mention this in the beginning of our conversation. Yes, sir. I'm also a director of the International Health and Wealth Movement. You'll hear yeah. more about that with the international platform, yeah. TV and radio, that I'm responsible of getting wow. great minds together yes. Yes. on that platform. I'll share that with Dr. Vaughn at another time. I love it. I love it's it, been Doc. a pleasure to be with you, Dr. Vaughn, and your wonderful listening audience. Absolutely. And I'll say this last word before I shut it down, my friend. And Doc, I want to also, too, if you wouldn't speak to our young people as much as the way you led there, our young people. You well, here's them. what we have. We have a youth program for the young people. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be an online program yeah. teaching them values, integrity, yeah. Yeah. how to treat young ladies, yeah. how to be all the moral stuff. Yeah. And we're going to teach them financial literacy, yeah. how to act, right. and all of that. The benefits of being a young person, mm -hmm. speaking in their language. We're going to have some speakers that actually focus in that community. Yeah. It's gonna be an online thing. And we want the guys. parents to be involved with that because yeah. we have to bring the young people up. And we yeah. have, yeah. the best example that you can put in front of a young person yep. is a good example. Absolutely, Doc. They watching folks, they so smart, they're brilliant. They're just watching us folks. They just watching they need some leadership, do. Some leadership and direction. Yeah. Okay? yeah. And so yeah. we're gonna have an online course, a youth program for that as well, Dr. Vaughn, okay? Fantastic, man. So with that being said, my brother, yeah. all you beautiful people, God bless you. Wow. Live long yes. and live strong in Jesus' name. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, that's why we have Dr. Stroman on Power Connections, ladies and gentlemen. He's our power player today. And this, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is so serious. This is very, very serious. And I want to encourage you to take action, okay? You guys can give me a call. And I'll make sure Doc, Doc get in touch with you as well if you want to do that. 404-401-0233. Most of you know that already. 404 401 fact, Doc, I want to put this out there too. Families, organizations, associations, and groups. Guess what? You can call Dr. Stroman about doing some virtual stuff, okay, with your team, okay, if you got to do that. Whatever it takes to get that done. You guys pull, pull your team together, pull your family together. We can do something virtual, okay, on the network. So that's not a problem. We just got to schedule it properly and see if Dr. Stroman's available. But I want you guys to start taking advantage of this time and information that Dr. Stroman is shared with. This is very serious, folks. Because I think, Doc, if I was to poll uh, everybody that we know, I don't think most people wouldn't want to not do what you said. <laughs> so I think most people would say, I need, you're right, I know, but I'm procrastinating. I know, I'm not doing it. I know, I don't know why I'm not doing it. The thing now, we got to change that mindset, folks. You got to get it done. Nobody goes around and say, I'm not going to eat, and then you die. Nobody does that. You just eat. You got to eat. You got to eat. You want you to, you got to drink water. You got to take care of your body. So, but guess what, Doc? It is a, a decision, though. It's a decision. 
And that's what we want to encourage you guys to make a decision today. We want to encourage you. Doc mentioned a key thing. We do all this in love, ladies and gentlemen. We ain't mad at you. We just want you to get excited about what you need to do <laughs> for yourself. So we do love you. And we know that Jesus is Lord on top of that. Doc, thank you so much for your time today, man. We salute you on the network. And uh, we're excited about, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be on YouTube. because It's going to be pushed out on LinkedIn, Twitter, uh, Instagram, and all the above. So be looking out for it. But most of all, I want you guys to push this out on your platforms because Dr. Stroman just dropped like, you know, $30,000 worth of information to you. Easy. <laughs> Y'all need to be sending in a donation or something to him. Now, thank Doc. You, for those who want to drop a seed or a donation, you got you got a cash app or something, man. Folks who want to donate some stuff to you, man. <laughs> thank God. <laughs> they need to be, they don't understand what you just said. <laughs> but anyway, for those who want to drop a seed, Doc, you got something for them. But do do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they can call me. I can give them my cash app. Yeah. Okay, great. Yeah, I want to encourage you guys. If y'all want to do that, draw a donation or, 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 or a seed. As you know, because when you sow seed in good soil, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to get a good harvest, no doubt about it. Well, Doc, thank you so much again. Man, Love you, my good. brother. Oh, yeah, man. We awesome, man. We, we definitely tied it to hit my brother from another mother. <laughs> that is my, bro my brother like no other. <laughs> hey, man, hey, man. God bless you. Thank well, you, thank Dr. Thank you Bond. so much, man. Love thank you, my you so much. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Power Connection with Dr. Anthony Stroman. Uh, we're excited about him being with us today. And uh, we are excited about you as well, on top of that. Hey, all, always, as Dr. Larry uh, Carnes would say later, always out love, out forgive, and out serve each other, ladies and gentlemen. We're just excited about what you're doing today. And uh, we want you to be part of what we're doing today as well, on top of that. But always out love, out forgive, and out serve each other. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, that Jesus is Lord. We're going to see you next time on the network. Hey, this is Elder Kevin Vaughn. Dr. Kevin Vaughn with you on Power Connections with our power player today, uh, Dr. Anthony Stroman. I want to hear from you guys too on this, and I want you guys to get uh, more information uh, back on that as well, okay? So I want you guys to be able to uh, share this information out that Dr. Stroman just shared with you today. So we're so excited about you, and we thank God for you. All right, you guys enjoy the rest of your day. And uh, again, push this out on your network, guys, and take care of your mind, take care of your body and take care of your financial health as well as Dr. Stroman shared with us a little earlier. Thank you so much, guys. We'll see you later. Remember to always out love, out forgive, and out serve each other. See you later, guys. Take care of yourself. And keep smiling. Keep smiling and tell somebody how much you love them. Bye.